yes, great, great to see you all again, uh, uh, Sadang. So uh, I'm Rohan, Royal Corporation, and a brief um, backstory about me is that uh, I've been running Royal Corporation and my virtual assistance company for uh, coming up to four years next month. Started in uh, in in just before pandemic. Um, and the, the journey has, has gone through lots of different aspects of outsourcing, but my true background, certainly with, within the automotive arena, has, has, has always been about processes and operations and, and how to make things, how to make a customer journey even better. Um, and, and I guess probably since um, for the last sort of six to seven months, I've been seriously focused on CRM tools and uh, partnering, partnering with many different CRM companies to make sure that I, I can offer services regardless of what your CRM system is, uh, to make that more slicker, more operational, and ultimately make us all some more money in our businesses. Um, so, um, so Janis, you'll, you'll give me a heads up on eight minutes as well. Yeah. Okay, um, so um, uh, for those that may or may not know, what, what is a CRM system? Well, um, I said this in my 60 seconds, it's a digital version of a virtual system, meaning this is a taskmaster that can look after various different aspects of your operations. Uh, and that's anything from storing financial information, looking after sales funnels, nurturing and, and customer relationships and uh, their customer journey from uh, quote to after sales and it's about forecasting and predicting how your business is going to shape in the future but how long has the crm systems been around well they go back pretty much from the dawn of time really ever, ever since the, there's been an accountancy piece then uh, and as long as it's been trade and money, then there's always been a recognition for us for a CRM system for something that can store, record, and monitor this information to help us predict and uh, and grow our businesses moving forward. Now, I'm not going to give you the whole story on the whole history of of, of the CRM system, but just more latterly in, in in the last latter years, probably in the last fifty years, um, we 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 tend to associate a CRM with a Rolodex system. Uh, recording other contacts and some key information that we'd store on our desktops that we can come back to contact those people at a, at a later stage. Um, but that moved into the digital version, into the digital world, uh, coming up into the 90s, into the 2000s, um, when more affordable digital versions of a CRM uh, all available for us. Um, today, for example, and, and, and moving forward, it is probably uh, now that we have things in the cloud, we have um, social CRM systems, AI technology. So the development and the evolution of the CRM system is, is continually growing and, and here to shape and define how we can nurture and look after our customers. Um, so what are the key things that I, I sort of work with with, with the CRM tools? Uh, and this is uh, all, all the usual aspects of operations from uh, customer service, looking after tickets when, when people have complaints, how do we manage those uh, tickets and inquiries that come in, um, implementing various different uh, plugins. We all want our, our financial aspects uh, plugged in and working with our CRM systems. We'll want phone integration, social, uh, our Facebook and our, our Instagram channels all uh, can link within our own CRM system. Um, and, and more specifically, we need to market, we need to email, and we need to keep our customers engaged. And all these things are that, that when used properly, it can be uh, a centerpiece when it's working with the CRM system. Um, some of those key benefits, are, it, it's all about reporting, improving revenue. That's probably one of the biggest things I, I get asked for. How can my CRM system make me more money? Because uh, people will invest in one of these and they'll want to make sure that they can have a wonderful return on their investment. Um, but traditionally, yes, it is here to help you increase uh, sales revenue, uh, but more importantly, making sure that it's looking after a customer journey and uh, the in-life uh, aspects and queries that a customer may have. Um, so um, one of the biggest things, I was going to do a, a little slideo, but, but probably one of the, I would say probably one in five people are probably not using the CRM system. Um, and and it's it's pretty adapt really that one of those main key reasons is because we don't know how to use and operate a CRM system. 
Well, we'll all jump to the market, pick up a CRM system like HubSpot, for example, and think that's rather expensive. So it's going to do everything that I need it to do. Um, but in reality and in truth, um, it is only a tool and a tool is only as good as, as the person who is operating that system. Uh, and most of us choose the wrong CRM system. We're having the wrong people using the CRM system or, or controlling it. Um, they haven't been set up correctly. Um, and we've all got many different expectations of what we want from a CRM system. And when those things don't work properly, this is the end result that we lose and, uh, and, and believe our CRM systems are failing us. Um, so when you invest in, in CRM management, uh, it's not about just purchasing a piece of software. It's about actually employing or investing in someone who is with either within the business or out of the business that can uh, effectively manage that, that, that process. Uh, it is a, it's a continuum. Uh, it's a continu continual development, especially as more and more data comes in into your CRM systems. Um, what you leave on there, fall asleep, uh, then uh, overnight, then your CRM is pretty much redundant. Um, but when you consider, and, and what most don't want to do is invest in the CRM because A, they can be quite costly, B, they don't want to outsource to, uh, to, to have it work. But what they're not realizing at the back end is more about the things that, uh, you know, if we all understand that a, a, a user correctly can increase those profits by 30% and that they can save around about 780 hours a year um, based on an average salary, well, that's, that's equivalent to 12 to 15,000 pounds a year for a single operative. Um, but these things will act as a salesperson, not just one, but two, but three, or even four salespeople. They will manage those uh, um, simple bookkeeping duties. Uh, they can engage in all your social media channels. And they also act as an administrator, making sure all your reporting and your offline duties are all taken care of. Um, so how do we find out what the best CRM uh, solution is? There are so many out there in, in, in the marketplace. And, and I guess this is one of the ultimate reasons why we can't find the correct system or the correct uh, partner for them. Uh, and one thing that we certainly do, certainly in Royal Corporation, is, is making sure that we can identify your industry and map it to the correct CRM system where you would essentially find out or, or, or become um, more adapt to and, and more suitability. So, for example, major corporate company with a uh, with a high Salesforce team would probably be more suited to something like Salesforce. If we're more about reports and operations, then we could be more suited to Zoho as an example. And if we want the blend of a bit of everything, then we may land up in pubs. Um, so it's it's about fine tuning and, and identifying not what we see. Uh, on a price comparison site, but actually understanding what each CRM system is suitable for and making sure you the right one. Um, and sort of my last slide is sort of how we can, how you can help me. Um, CRMs uh, and, and my referrals and, and the industries that I look looking to work and, and implement my CRM systems into are my trusted local trades, independent vehicle retailers, uh, business coaches, social media, social media agencies, perfect, thanks, Janice, and VAs. Um, and uh, and in return with our with, with our CRM systems is that we can uh, look at referrals and introductory packages and agency packages too. Uh, so that's it from me. I hope uh, that was a, a quick round robin of the CRM system and how you should all maximize the benefits of it. And if there is any time, I'll have any questions.